And moving on from life outside the office to signs of life outside Earth. For ages, scientists have been searching for signs of life in space and the latest celestial body to grab their attention for the same reason is Saturn's smallest moon, Mimas, also known as the Death Star. Pretty ironic. Scientists believe Mimas has an ocean under its icy shell which brings together all the conditions for necessary life. Here's our report for the latest. For years, scientists have been trying to find a sign of life in our solar system. And the latest to join their area of interest is Saturn's small moon, Mimas. Its appearance, similar to Darth Vader's space station in the Star Wars film, has got it the nickname Death Star. Scientists believe that Mimas could be hiding a deep ocean under its 20 to 30 kilometer thick ice shell. Scientists claim Mimas brings together all the conditions necessary for habitability. But unlike other celestial bodies with subterranean oceans, the presence of water on Mimas comes as a surprise to the scientists. For years, space researchers believed Mimas has a solid rock interior. Its craggy and crater-riddled surface showed no signs of underlying geologic activity. And it has a diameter of only 400 kilometers. Therefore, the scientists thought Mimas did not have conditions favourable to life until they analysed the Moon's rotations between 2004 and 2017. They took thousands of pictures of the Moon and detected tiny oscillations. The movements observed led to the conclusion that Mimas has a subsurface ocean. The ocean could possibly account for more than half of Mimas's volume and its formation could be relatively recent. It could have been formed in the past 5 to 15 million years. This explains why signs of ocean's existence on Mimas are yet to rise and smooth its surface. Scientists attribute the existence of oceans on Mimas to the influence of other Saturn moons. The tidal effects of other moons must have shook Mimas and created the necessary heat. This heat would have melted the ice inside the icy shell of Mimas. And with this, the Saturn's Death Star has joined a growing family of icy moons that are thought to harbour inner oceans. The other members include Mimas's fellow Saturn satellites Enceladus and Titan and Jupiter's Europa and Ganymede. This brings us back to where we started from. With the presence of water, can these celestial bodies harbour primitive forms of life? From impeachments to inaugurations, if it's a political story, we are on the scene. The race for the White House is heating up. We're beating Biden. How dare he say that? If it's breaking news, we're live with the latest coverage. From the White House, the State Department, and Capitol Hill, we know the issues, but above all, we know the players to bring you the latest in-depth analysis on all the key stories that we're covering. I'm Eric Ham. Join me from Washington here on First Pulse America.